Hi you guys, okay, I'm going to do another hair tutorial today because I found out while I was playing around with my hair, something actually happens. It's another way to make your hair wavy, it's kind of like a wavy crimp, it's a severe wave, kind of, yeah, like a severe wave, like something, I don't know, like a severe wave, I keep saying that. But, this is something you can only do overnight, unlike the braids where you can just wear those through the day, then take them out and your hair is all wavy. But this one you have to go overnight. And your hair has to be like super duper tangle free because if you brush it out, it pretty much dies pretty quickly. Like I used it and you can see there's a slight wave, but if I went like this a bunch more times, see look at how fast it's gone from being super wavy to really straight. So you need your hair like brush it out if you need to use detangler. I found this from a long time ago, so I think I'm going to use it, even though my hair barely has any, like, tangles. So this, it's if you have wet or dry hair, just spray it in. It's detangler. And because it's the kid's one, if you spray it in your eye like I just did, it's kind of just like water because it's no tear. Because when I was a little, little kid, um, I used to have, like, tangles all the time. So, anyway, my hair is brushed out. Again, like the pigtail, like the braided ponytail, separate your hair into two about even sections. What you're going to do, it's similar to a braid, except for you divide your hair into two and you just twist it around and around and around. And you're thinking, well, that's pretty easy. Why? How does that make your hair wavy? Well, what you have to do is you have to make sure that it's really, 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 really tight. So. Oh, that looks cool because it's all dark and then it's that burst of light. So then you take an elastic. And it's okay if it loses some of its, like, uh, like, tightness while you're putting in the elastic. Because, see, look at how it can do that. Well, that's why you roll it back up again. That's the magic of this technique. And you take a pin. I'm using my little flower pins from Forever 21 and you just make sure that it sticks to your head. I would, don't use a bobby pin because it can't hold it like these pins. It can hold a lot more hair than a bobby pin and it stays in better. Then you do the same for this side and I'll teach you, like most of you are probably thinking right now, well, isn't this gonna fall out overnight? Well, that's where the part after this comes in. So, yeah. I say so, yeah, and go like this a lot, don't I? It's because I have a bunch of senior moments. If you guys don't know what a senior moment is, it's, you know how sometimes elderly people forget stuff? Well, that's like a senior moment because they're seniors and they're having a moment where they forget something. Well, I have a bunch of those. Yeah, iPod, iPhone 4 came out a bunch of days ago, so, yeah because I don't have the fancy, uh, the fancy technical stuff like the shelf on. I can't like do one side and then skip ahead and it's all done. See like that almost fell down. That's where the hat comes in. It has to be a beanie. It has to, has to, has to be a beanie. I could have used my red one or my blue one, but it, it's okay if it starts to die under the hat because the hat's still keeping it contained. And the elastic comes in because if it does come, like, the pins come out while your hair is in the hat, your hair will still be in the elastic and it'll still be up there because of the hat. So try to make the hat as big as possible still. Oh, I look like a Smurf. No, wait, Smurfs have white hats, don't they? Yeah. 
So it kind of looks like you've just got chemo, but it works. Then you keep it in overnight, try to keep it in as much as possible because say I took a little strand and I just did that. What you can also do is if you don't have time, well, it's probably not gonna work as well. Like maybe if you hold it in for like 20 minutes or so, it might get a slight little wave, but if you want the actual, actual, actual wave, then you're gonna have to use this technique overnight. But like, I would suggest doing it with more hair because if you want to like use the small strand and then do that technique, you can just roll it up really tight and just walk around with it for like a bunch of hours. Like if you did that and then you like twisted it up and everything I just did, except for you don't put it up with the clip. <coughs> I am okay now. So did everything I just did except for using the hair clips and using the beanie. Just walk around, twist it, and make sure it's tight, and then just walk around like that for five to like eight hours. I don't think you want to do that, but it'll also work. I like this method much better. Also, if it gets cold at night and it's nice and it's nice, and you can walk, walk around in your house and they're like, okay. And I know I kind of look like a boy right now. But anyway, I hope you guys like this video. Even though most of it I was just talking nonsense. But I, you, I think you guys learned some stuff. But anyway, um, yeah. Hope you guys try it. Remember the first step though. I'll go over the steps again. Detangle. Brush. The twisty braidy thingy hair elastic, other side. Put it up with clips and put on the hat. Okay, now I hope you guys try it and I hope it works. So, still remember to fan the back of Blue SCP page. Uh, that's something you should do. And I think that's it. So, good luck you guys, bye.